Hey everybody, Jeff aka Gkers here with my second unboxing of the day. Uh, I got a package today. It had two Transformers and two different Transformers, of course. Uh, both are from the Wreck and Rule collection. I just got done unboxing the first uh, first package, which was the Diaclone Deluxe Class Twin uh, Twin Twist. I almost said Twin Cast, but I said Twin Twist. What is the other package that came today? You'll have to stay tuned to find out. So, like I said, I got two packages from Amazon today. I already did the first one, which was Twin Cast, uh, the Wreck and Rule collection. The next one I'm going to be doing an unboxing of is the Prime Universe Voyager Class Bulkhead. Uh, overall, you know, I'm, I'm ho holding out some. I'm holding out my hype for this. Because it looks like this figure actually comes with uh, another different accessory, basically. Now, I actually own the Legacy Bulkhead. I got this figure from Amazon. It was via their used warehouse. They said that the, fig that the figure was intact and everything. That basically it was just a box that was damaged. They basically lied to me. The figure actually, somebody stole the Wrecking Ball accessory. But it came with the little uh, thing on the back, his little, you know, like tarp or whatever you want to call it. It's supposed to be a shield, but in his alt mode, it's supposed to be like a tarp or something that goes over the back of the truck. It has his blaster slash minigun. Is this thing supposed to be a minigun? I can't tell by the way, with the way the barrel looks, though. But it doesn't, I don't have the wrecking ball. I'm not gonna, I wasn't going to fucking fight Amazon over a plastic little wrecking ball, you know, so fuck it. So, I got this guy, and I'm hoping that the uh, Wreck and Rule collection up, you know, up, you know, upgrades that uh, version of Bulkhead that I already own. By the looks of it, you get the a hammer. That's supposed to be, like, the new addition to this character. Or you can see actually see the hammer in the image to my, uh, to my right, or maybe my left, however you're looking at it. But... So, and it also comes with a different paint uh, job. He's, he's supposed to be like looking like he's camouflaged. But on Cybertron, which is basically a giant planet so that's about cities, I don't think there's forests or anything. Why would it, uh, b big old bulk and needed where it have camo? It isn't like he's in the forest or anything, you know? But anyway, let's get to that unboxing, shall we? Okay, so we are about to get into this box. Well, I'm I'm gonna get in the box. You're gonna you know see what's on, see what the figure looks like and everything after I get out of the box, because right now I don't have a secondary webcam. The webcam I cam I actually use for the unboxing perspective it actually burned out. So basically, I still have this one. I really haven't been to the store in the last few days. So, but shit happens, right? So let's switch it over to. Let's switch it over to the full screen. There we go. And then I'll just turn off that. There you go. Okay, so like I said, oh, I forgot to actually say what was on the box. I forgot to say what was on the box because I was so I was so fucking underwhelmed by the twin cast box the wreck and rule twin cast box. Honestly, I'm still fucking underwhelmed. On the front, you have the the artwork. Here, shitty artwork on the sides, nothing new there. Legacy Wreck and Rule collection on the top. Useless fucking j illegal jab legal garbage on the bottom. On the back, 31 steps to convert this big motherfucker. There, like I said, nothing new here, ladies and gentlemen. With well, the box, you know, like they don't even give fucking bulkhead a, pro a, a profile on the side. He had a profile of the motherfucking legacy box. Why does he have a profile on this box? I guess I'm guessing the higher ups at Hasbro were beating off too much of th this fucking picture that they had. You know, oh my god, this picture's fucking perfect. They're probably busting one out when they think about that picture. Let's get this motherfucker opened up, shall we? So there, got this. Hopefully it'll be nice and easy to get this figure out like it was the twin twist figure. 
If I can get the damn, there it goes. Okay. Okay, so what is this box going to look like? Okay. Hmm. Oh my god, we got one of these! We got one of these, guys! We got one! Fuck, so shit out of here. White piece of paper garbage. Get that shit out of here. Get that fucking shit out of here. Okay, box is empty. Box is empty, so get that fucking shit out of there. Okay, so on the front, we basically have everything that you're going to get. You got the... Wait, hold on the fuck is that thing oh okay so you got the figure you got bulkhead and his camo goodness you have his uh little minigun slash blaster you have his wrecking ball you have a real shitty looking hammer i thought this thing would have been decent but that fucking hammer looks like shit that hammer look at it look at it hasbro look look there look at that shit look at that shit and then on the back you have the uh, the little the the oh, what the fuck this thing is called like the, it's the cover it's the fucking cover and of course I don't have my scissors oh I do have a pair of scissors thank God I got my scissors right here okay so let's start cutting this motherfucker open shall we let's start with the first thing that's closest to me which is that goddamn hammer look at this look at this look at this look at this shit. <laughs> embarrassing fucking embarrassing Hasbro why are you embarrassing me like that okay next up let's get the wrecking ball okay so we got the wrecking ball I think it's a wrecking ball I don't really fucking care what it is at least I got it this time around <laughs> next up we got the minigun mini gun slash blaster Wait, hold on. Am I okay? Yeah, good. Mini gun slash blaster. Is it a mini gun? Is it a blaster? Hell, I don't know. It's meant to kick ass, though. <laughs> oh my god. There, just fucking tear the whole paper. There we go. Oh my god. There we go. Okay, this one. It's actually all. It's like a translucent plastic. There you go. It's translucent. Well, the other one was also translucent plastic. But this is translucent black plastic. The other one was like a bluish color, if I remember correctly. I still can't tell. Is this supposed to be like a fucking minigun? Because the barrel makes it look like it's a minigun, but it's fucking small to be a minigun. Compare that with... Oh, uh, what? where the fuck is it? Oh, here we go. Compare that with the minigun from the leader class Skyquake. This is a minigun. What the fuck is this shit? Look at it! Look at it, Amazon! Or Hasbro! <laughs> uh, okay. Okay, let's get the figure cut loose. There's that. You know, I should fucking trademark that shit. Look at it, Hasbro! <laughs> Look at it! Look at it! Ah, oh, crap. They, they attach these goddamn ties so tight to the figure. Like, try, trying to remove them is like fucking a lottery, you know? You try to get, you're afraid to get your scissors too close to the figure because you're worried it's going to damage the figure. Oh my god, it looks like... This has to be a fucking sick joke on Hasbro's part, you know? <laughs> Let's get these things so fucking tight on the figure that they're going to end up cutting the figure and then they'll buy another figure it's excellent i tell you it all makes fucking sense okay here is bulkhead in his camo uh with his camo on why does he he's on a fucking planet that's a giant city basically why the fuck is he wearing does he have camo if anything, it should be like an urban camo. This is like a woodland camo. How the fuck do I know if it's woodland camo or not? I play. I played a lot of Call of Duty when I was younger. The motherfucker. I always had woodland camo. Yeah. 
Okay, so this is uh, bulkhead, front, side, back, here, there you go, back, other side. On the, his, they changed out his Autobot symbol, it is the Wrecker symbol. It's the same symbol that they uh, use on Twin Cat. Twin Twist. I almost said, I almost said Twin Cast, I meant, but it's Twin Twist. Okay, so let's get... Let's get this uh, the covering. God damn it. There you go. And here is the covering, tarp, whatever. It's supposed to be, it's a shield basically, but I'm, the function when it, he's in his alt mode, I think it's supposed to be like a, like a tarp or something. Fuck, I don't know. I honestly don't care. You know. Okay, and here it is. Here it is. Look at it! Look at it! Okay, so let's get this guy armored up. So the first thing I gotta figure out is how does the wrecking ball work? Okay, so the wrecking ball just kind of opens up like a clamshell. You know what a clamshell is, right? Okay, so let's... I'm guessing it just kind of goes over his hand like this. Oh, hold on. Hold on, I got... Oh, get that fucking tie off his hand. Jesus fucking Christ. There. Ugh. We're, we're, earth, we're earth friendly. We're getting rid of plastic. They just make a whole bunch of these fucking shitty paper ties. Which still kills a bunch of motherfucking trees. Okay, so let's... There's that. Okay, so we got the wrecking ball... On this poor sad sack of shit. Bam! 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 Look at it! Look at it! <laughs> okay, so there's that. This fuck. This is about as. My god, look at this shit! Ah, hammer! It's hammer time! Bam, bam, clank! Bam, bam, clank! Oh, God damn. Okay, now for time for the gun. Where the fuck did I put the gun at? Ah, uh, here you are. Here you are. Here is the gun. Now, ooh, look, can I put the gun on top of the... Oh my God, I actually can. Aha! Look at that! It's a wrecking ball with a gun on it. <laughs> it really negates the whole idea of having the wrecking ball. It, yeah, I think it's a wrecking ball, isn't it? What, what's the point of having the wrecking ball if you have the gun on it? Because you're supposed to be able to bash shit with the wrecking ball, but you have the gun, and then you bash shit with the, wreck, with the wrecking ball with the gun attached, it's going to destroy the gun. Try saying that fucking five times fast. <laughs> oh my god. Ugh. Ugh. It's a, it's something you can do with these figures, I guess. Okay, now, I've always saw, I saw it before, that this is supposed to attach somewhere on the back. I just don't know where. Um, oh, hold on, can it go right there? I'm guessing I can put the gun there. But I thought it was off on the shoulder, though, but I don't see a spot. I'm, I'm going to have to take a look later. But, yeah, that, that totally looks fucking wrong. That looks wrong. Let's get that poor gun off there. Okay, so as always, I just put this, uh, the cover over here like this. Hold on. There you go. Ah, there you go. Oh, yeah, this isn't totally inconspicuous at all. Uh, motherfucker's just walking down the street with his, with his woodling camo on. Uh, but here you go. Here is Bulkhead with his hammer, his wrecking ball, and just for shits and giggles, let's put the gun on top of the wrecking ball. There you go. There you go. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's fucking intimidating right there, isn't it? A wrecking ball with a gun on top. Yeah, yeah! Yeah!
<laughs> okay, so stay tuned, and I'll be right back with my final thoughts for the Legacy Wreck and Rule Collection Voyager Class Bulkhead. Stay tuned, and I'll be right back. Alrighty, you awesome people out there. It is time for my final thoughts of for the uh, Legacy Wreckers uh, Wreck and Rule Voyager Class Bulkhead. Oh my god, these these tiles are getting so fucking long. Holy shit. Anyway, what do I think? Overall, I think this is a pretty good uh, re-release of the figure. I actually like this figure more than I do the goddamn Twin Cast. That I just did a review, uh, not a review, an unboxing of. Why? Because this figure actually comes with the hammer. It's it, it's one accessory, but it's something different they added. They could have let literally just released the figure with his with his wrecking ball slash gun weapon of death and the little his little riot shield with shielding or whatever the kind of fucking shield it is. They could have literally just released that figure with those with those uh, accessories along with the camo. But they added the hammer. This guy, literally, you get the same two weapons, and they don't even fucking acknowledge the Titan Master gimmick. So, because of that, I, I like this guy a little bit more than I do Twin Twist. It's nice that he, this guy has, you know, the, the you know that he came with the Wrecking Ball, since I, the Wrecking Ball, I didn't get the Wrecking Ball with the other bulkhead because I got it from the used warehouse from Amazon and Amazon fucking lied about the figure hat. Have you noticed that all this, that it just gives a generic description when you read it? It just says box damage, but it, they, they should come with photos. These, the Amazon warehouse should come with photos of what you're going to buy. That way you can actually tell, hey, that motherfucker didn't have a wrecking ball, you know. But yeah, so I overall like this guy. I like this guy. He He's actually a pretty good uh, re-release of Legacy Bulkhead. These both came out in the same product line, the Legacy line, basically. But yeah, so, I'm overall you know excited with, to have this guy. He actually looks like he could put up a decent fight, even if he has a gun sticking out of his wrecking ball. <laughs> but, so, that is it, ladies and gentlemen. I'm not sure if I'm good. I should be getting the final three boxes or packages over the next couple days. So you can guarantee I'm going to be doing unboxing of them. I'm just not sure if anything's coming in tomorrow or if it's all coming in on Saturday. But when I get another, another figure, you can guarantee I'm going to be doing an unboxing. So until then, my name is Jeff, a.k.a. G. Curse, wishing you all a great day. Stay safe, everybody. And remember, rock and roll. Look at it. Look at it.